All right, well, welcome to another quick desktop review on something really neat we've just started using um, around here, and it's this guy um, by Magwell. This is an NDI to HDMI converter. Now we've talked about NDI before. It is a protocol that allows you to route video from say a camera, like our Honey Optics PTZ here, um, over your normal data network, your ethernet network that you plug your computers to and everything else into. It lets you run your video at very low latency, low latency, um, over that network. What this guy lets you do is pretty neat. You can plug this into that same network, so into your wired data network like everything else plugs into, and then you get HDMI out. So an NDI source, any NDI source, whether it's from a camera, from your computer, wherever it is you're getting from, you can translate that into an HDMI that you can then put up on a screen. A couple of places we found use for this. Um, little guy is taking the feed um, from one of our main cameras um, and being able to display that feed in its kind of raw form in another room. Um, so say in the nursery. So you could have a video feed of your main space into secondary places like nursery. I mean, I suppose even the bathroom if you wanted to or wherever. And it's not dependent on your or live streaming or anything else. Nothing has to be turned on except for the camera and this guy. Another uh, great use case is a lot of presentation software. We use Faith Life Proclaim here, but I believe Media Shout and the others can do the same. They can take your feed, the feed that you put up on your screens, um, and make an NDI feed out of it. So you can feed a screen, um, your basically your presentation, without having um, like to connect an HDMI cable or something between them. Pretty much anywhere that you're going to be on the same network, you can plug in one of these guys. So a lot of really cool uses for this, but let me mock it up for you and show you how it works. All right, I have my box all hooked up to the TV behind me. That's the HDMI out right here. Um, I've got data and power running over a PoE connection, power over Ethernet connection. This will can run by that. If you don't have PoE um, available on your network, you can run this off of USB power. It's a standard USB connector. Um, this USB connector connecting um, this to your computer over the USB connector is how you set it up in the first place. Obviously, this is a device on your network, so it needs to have an IP address on your network. And the easiest way to do that is to hook your computer up to it and then go through its setup process. Once you have it though and connect it to your network, one of the great things about NDI is that NDI is discoverable. If there is an NDI source on your network, it's broadcasting that it's there and things like this box can discover it. So you can actually switch between sources right on the box. So right now what you're seeing um, is the feed from my presentation software. So there's a computer running the presentation software um, in another part of the completely other part of the building um, and but it's on the same network so i'm getting that feed there i can also bring up the little on-screen menu um, as you can see go down and um, to source hit select go down and you can see everything that's labeled unicast Unicast is the different NDI sources. So we have Proclaim, which is the thing we're watching now. And then we have a couple of different uh, camera feeds um, as well. So let's click on one of those. And you can see this is a camera actually sitting right here on my desk, the Honey Optics you saw earlier. There it is, um, again, streaming directly in real time. There we go, there's my hand, real time. Streaming directly in real time over my data network to my little box here. Um, it's simple, it's kind of a one trick thing, but the trick that it does is actually really, really helpful um, for helping get video um, from multiple sources um, to perhaps far flung places um, in your facility, basically anywhere you can get a wired network connection.
All right, that is the Magwell NDIH HDMI box. Um, what's important to note is that there are manufacturers who make basically the opposite of this, uh, a box that will take HDMI in uh, and then convert it to NDI uh, for consumption anywhere on your network. Uh, so if you've got a camera um, that doesn't do NDI natively and you want to take a feed from that, if you've got presentation software that doesn't do it, um, or whatever the situation might be, say you want to take your live stream mix. So you've got your final live stream mix uh, coming out uh, on HDMI from whatever you're using uh, as your switcher, your ATM mini, uh, Studio, whatever it is, you've got that HDMI feed and you want to feed it to other parts of your facility, well, that's probably coming out uh, final form in HDMI. You can get another box that's basically the opposite of this one, takes the HDMI in, makes NDI that can be consumed anywhere. NDI is an open standard, which means that it doesn't have to be, the, the sending units and receiving units don't have to be from the same, same manufacturers um, at all if you don't want to. Another note is that OBS, if you are using OBS to stream, OBS can make an NDI feed out of your output. So your final mixed stream um, from OBS, you can say to publish as an NDI feed um, to any boxes you may have running around your space. So again, um, super easy, super convenient, um, and can really simplify your cabling. That really is the party trick for NDI in general, um, is it really, really simplifies your cabling so that your whole video infrastructure can simply run off your wired ethernet connections that you probably already have anyway. All right, well, there are links um, for this. Um, associate links in the description really helps me out if you click on those. Um, also, so you know, um, Honey Optics has given me um, a special discount code uh, for $125 off their camera. So if you're in the market for a PTZ camera, check out um, the link in the uh, description and you can get $125 off, which is a great deal. All right, well, until we see each other again, thank you for joining me. Oh my goodness, one extra cool thing I just came across as I was filming some extra footage here. Because this is NDI and because this little box is pretty smart, it knows that right now it has a PTZ camera hooked up to it. So I can come into my box itself, click on PTZ, come down here and actually control my camera straight from the buttons on the box. That, that's pretty cool. Not sure how useful it is, but it's neat. Hey everybody, if you found that video helpful, please hit like and subscribe, and also check the video description for links to any products you've seen in today's videos. Doing that really helps support this channel. Also, don't forget to leave a comment with any questions that you may have. A lot of the content I do is based directly on the questions of the feedback you give, so keep that coming, and I will keep making them. Thank you.